I'm gonna do a quick and dirty recording of this PS5 controller real quick. If you hook it up USB-C, it shows up as a input and output device here. And um, so the input device, there are two microphones. You have the first one and the second one on the back here. And I did some mini tests with those. I won't show you here, but this shows up as input two. And this one back here seems to be some kind of hardware noise canceling and it shows up as input one and you get some real neat and weird dirty sounds out of it. Uh, but what I wanted to show here was the outputs. Uh, it is a four output device and outputs uh, one and two, I would assume are the speaker controller or the speaker on the controller, but I can't get that working might be a firmware update, might be disabled. You may need some kind of key to get into it. Uh, output three and four is live though. And that is the new rumble feature. So if I, as soon as I unmute this uh, test oscillator, we get rumble. And as I adjust the, uh, adjust the sine wave here, or square wave rather. And we can take it and we have our pan control and pan it left for the left motor, pan it right for the right motor. Um, but where this is gonna get fun, where this is gonna get fun is the uh, other sounds going on. So I just put up some pink noise. I'm gonna switch this EQ to a band pass. You can kind of sweep it around and feel like you're getting some wind sounds going on. I'll crank the... So it's going to be... I think this operates very close to how the Joy-Con works. I know you can listen to like Mario Kart and hear coin sounds coming out of the controller. Um, this is obviously going to be programmed very similarly to that. It should be fun to see what people do with it. <laughs> 